Hello, good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, Miss. We'll wait for the others to join before we start the class. Okay. Hello, sir. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you very much for asking. How about you? Yes, I'm fine. Thank you. Okay. We'll wait for more participants. Okay. okay.
Okay, it seems that Ms. Ruth is having difficulties to join us. Good afternoon, Mr. Ariona. Good afternoon. Okay, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh, Miss Ruth is already one minute trying to. Ah, uh, there she is. Okay. Hello, good afternoon, ma'am. Mr. Anik, could you please turn on your video? Okay, now that everybody is on, welcome to LIA conversation class. Uh, my name is Tati Siregar. It's nice to meet all of you on our Zoom class. So the first thing that we are going to do besides our unit one, is also talking about introduction. Can you please introduce a little about yourself? So um, something interesting about yourself, besides your name, maybe where you were born, or maybe your hobby, or maybe the films that you like. So uh, allow me to start with myself. So my favorite film is probably oldies. I like films from the 70s, 80s, and 90s. And my hobby is reading. At the moment, I'm reading a book about an Indian superstar. <laughs> That's how random my reading is. <laughs> so anybody else wants to do the introduction? Let's start with Ms. Ruth as the only lady here. Would you please start the introduction, ma'am? Okay, thank you, Miss. Uh, I think I'm the only lady because uh, we have you in this uh, room, yeah. Um, okay, uh, I introduce myself. My name is Ruth Sihaan. Maybe uh, I'm the workmate, the colleagues for uh, the other three handsome men there. Um, I'm working in the finance area, and then um, if we're talking about film, I like watching movies uh, and series, but uh, now I like watching about Korean stuff, okay, yeah. like Korean drama, <laughs> Korean reality show, and K-pop, and um, the hobby that I currently doing is sleeping on weekend because of the pandemic. Uh, we cannot, we limited our, our staff for going out because we're worried about it getting infected by the uh, COVID-19. Yeah, that's all for me. Maybe uh, we can go to the other handsome guys there. <laughs> okay, thank you very much, Miss Ruth. Uh, the next one, yeah. perhaps uh, Mr. Randy, because you were the first one to come. Thank you very much for coming on time. Sir, we cannot hear your voice. I can't, I can't hear your voice, Randy. Second. Okay, check, go on. Hey, my name is Randy Gunawan. I'm 28 years old, and my hobby is listening music. Uh, Okay, enough. <laughs> <laughs> uh, don't you like like watching films or movies? Uh, little, little. A little. Okay, A little. So okay. What kind of music or what kind of songs do you like? 
uh, I like random genre. Mm. <laughs> uh, sometimes I like listening rock music. Uh, sometimes uh, 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 mungkin uh, maybe apa sih? Disney music pun oke. Okay. Disney is okay. okay. Disney's okay. okay. Yeah. <laughs> I listening with my <laughs> wife. In... Okay. Thank you very much, Mr. Andy. Um, the next one, this is between Mr. Wira or Mr. Aryono. Volunteers, up to you. Okay. okay. Go on, then. Introduce myself. My name is Aryono. I'm Biarto, but my nickname is Adit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, I am uh, work as assistant manager at uh, PT JSM. Um, my hobby is playing game, uh, PlayStation, uh, and I have two daughter and one son. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I love them very much. Okay. That's it. Okay, thank you, Mr. Ariono. Um, you said you like playing games. What kind of uh, genre do you like to play? Uh, I like uh, sport. Uh, yes, no. Oh, yes, sport. PlayStation and the actually, uh, especially uh, football games. Oh, okay. Yes, FIFA. <laughs> okay, okay then. Thank you so much, Mr. Ariano. Mr. Vera, could you please? Finally, me. <laughs> Good afternoon, everyone. Good My afternoon. My name is uh, Virawan Alexander Doni. It's such a uh, Japanese name. But you can call me Vera. Okay. Uh, or you can call me Alex. It's up to you. I was born in Jakarta. And my hobby is uh, playing music, playing guitar, and singing. I like a pop pop song or rock song, yeah. And my favorite movies is action movies, mm -hmm. uh, like uh, Marvel. Uh, uh, <laughs> Marvel. Everyone everyone likes Marvel. <laughs> okay. And uh, I'm a father with two adorable kids, a daughter, one daughter and one son. Nice. That's all about me. Okay, thank you very thank much, you. Mr. Wira. Um, May I ask who your favorite superhero is? My favorite superhero is uh, Captain Vera America. <laughs> Captain Vera, Captain America. Captain I'm Vera a team Surabaya. of Captain America. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Amevira. Okay. Yeah, I'm Nevira. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so um, our first unit is pretty easy. It's actually about introducing ourselves. You have done well with introducing yourself. Thank you very much. But the deal that we're going to do is how to uh, continue that introduction into small talk. So if you take a look at your book, we are going to try to do some small talk in our first introduction. May I share my screen, please? There you go. So I'm going to go straight to page three. I hope my laptop is going to be fine. Ah, there you go. So we have several topics for small talks. So we have travel places, job studies, interests, hobbies, weather. Some of us already talked about our hobbies, but then again, when we do small talk, it doesn't just stop when you talk about your hobby, like you say your hobby and then the conversation stops. It needs to be continued. So eventually from that small talk, we get to know about our partner more. Now, this is what we're going to do first. Uh, I'm going to try, I'm going to ask you to choose one topic but it must be different topic each. So I'm going to start with Mr. Vira. Which topic do you choose? 
actually travel. Travel, okay. Mr. Ariono? I choose uh, interest or hobbies. Interest or hobbies. Miss Ruth? Um, job. Job, okay. And Mr. Andy? Weather. You only have studies or weather, unfortunately. Weather. The weather, okay. This is what we're going to do. So each of you are going to have, uh, is going to have a small talk with me for two minutes. So let's try and keep this small talk going for two minutes. Don't make pauses too long and don't try to dominate the conversation. Do you, uh, uh, do you know what to do? Yep. How long are we going to have the conversation, the small talk? Minutes. Each person? Two minutes. Two minutes. Two minutes. Okay. Uh, Two minutes. What are you not allowed to make? Uh, Talking dominate. too much. Uh, dominate the conversation. conversation. Dominating and uh, making pauses too long. Okay. Let's start with Mr. Wira. You chose yeah. travel, right? Yes. Okay. Let's okay. try. So, uh, Mr. Wira, have you ever been to Bali? Yes, of course. Hmm. How do you like it? I like it very well. Uh, very much. No, uh, very much. Yeah. Uh, I think Bali is the one of the most beautiful island in Indonesia. Oh, I see. So, uh, do you, you have been to Bali before, ma'am? Yes, I've been to Bali also, uh, but it's been a long time since I went there. How about you? When was the last time you go there? Uh, last time I'll go, I'll go there before pandemic is 2019, I think. 2019. Oh. Yes, uh, because the pandemic makes me makes uh, makes me. Crazy. Uh, I have. <laughs> I don't have time to travel. How about you? What last time you go to Bali? Uh, the last time was probably when I was in high school. It's been twenty years or so. It's been a long time, right? Whoa! I think yeah. Bali has changed a lot. What do you like about Bali anyway? Uh, I like the beach. Uh, I like the kuta, and uh, the food is very, uh, it's very nice. And I think so. I said, how about you? What you like about Bali? Well, Bali had so many memories for me, at least for my childhood, because. Uh, when I was in primary school, we used to go to Bali like three times a year. And then by the time I got to high school, we went there less and less, okay? <laughs> so it was okay. for my childhood memories, I think. Thank you so much, Mr. Wira. Those are very Thank good. You. Two minutes, well done. Can we give applause for Mr. Wira? <laughs> done. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so, the next one is Mr. Ariano. You chose interests, hobbies? Yes, I do. So, uh, Mr. Ariano, what was your favorite game again? My favorite game is football. And uh, once a week, I play uh, the real football. Ah, I didn't know that you actually played real fo uh, football. Do you have a team or just a random people who come to play with you? Yes, I have a team. Uh, at uh, uh, my team is uh, uh, real estate or uh, complex uh, neighborhood neighborhood team, uh, and uh, I like play with them very well. Uh, how about 
you uh what is your favorite uh apa? sport oh speaking of sport i'm not really into sport i do like reading for my hobby though uh, um, uh what is your last book if have you read mm, at the moment i'm still reading a book about indian superstar so um it's quite interesting for me because uh she has been i've known her not really known but i followed her since a long time ago and recently there was this book about her biography so mm -hmm. i really enjoyed the book mm -hmm. oh by the way mr ariana when you play football with your team do you play it like two two times 45 minutes just like the real game or just for fun <laughs> No, no, I just play one uh, forty-five minute uh, or uh, one one round or apa ya satu babak ya. Oh, <laughs> oh no, no okay. Indonesia, no Indonesia. Yeah, okay, <laughs> uh, but uh, I have uh, uh, measure my my uh, my running with my gadget uh, with my oh. Garmin watch. Uh, uh, I've run uh, 2.3 kilometer in mm -hmm. 45 minutes. It's uh, very, very uh, tired. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I agree. Yeah. I usually uh, walk about 7 kilos per day, so about 10,000 feet per day. Mm. So, but not running. I cannot do running. So walking only for me. Mm. Thank you very much, Mr. Adjona. That's a very good one. Uh, although, try to speak it in English, no matter what. <laughs> okay. No matter what, yes. <laughs> Ms. Ruth, ready for your part? Yeah, you yes. chose job. Oh, there are so many things that I want to know about your job. <laughs> no, you're getting <laughs> handy, Anna. <laughs> so, uh, Ms. Ruth, you told me that you were in finance? Yeah, that's right. What do you do actually? Um, finance. Uh, what what kind of job? Eh, what kind of things I do is um, like this. What we call it? Okay. Uh, I'm doing financing about um, projecting the business, the business plan, making the business plan for our company from this from this year up to the end of our concession period and then um, I'm managing the the payment although or, although that's uh, made by my uh, underline by underling sorry by my underling by my uh, subordinate and then I approve the payment and then um, I'm coordinating about the financing activity in this uh, in this office uh, Right kind of the job. Uh, I'm sorry. I, I can I can't uh, find the true uh, find the correct words about describing my job description. It's okay. Uh, <laughs> this is our first meeting anyway, so yeah, yeah, yeah. You should not be too deep into your yeah, job. I, I, I try to find the uh, the common common word that uh, maybe for the non financial people will understand, but it's blank in my in my my mind. <laughs> okay. Um. How about you, Miss Miss Devi? Oh. Um. At the moment, I'm teaching at Lia Gayung Sari, as you've known. Um, okay. I've been teaching here for six years, five years, but okay. I've been teaching as a an English teacher for almost fifteen years. So. Uh. Before this, I was in another institution. Oh, so you're the expert from the other institution? <laughs> <laughs> Not really. <laughs> okay. Uh, um, do you actually, did you go to a university that has the same major as your job at the moment? Yes, I do. I am have, I have the economic background. Oh. And my job is all about uh, accounting and finance and management. Thank you so much, Ms. Ruth.
That was also two minutes. Well done. Uh, Mr. Randy, the weather. This is the most common <laughs> small talk ever. I try my best. Okay. So, uh, Mr. Randy, are you still at the office at the moment? Yes, I'm at oh. the office right now. Do you think it's hot? It's a hot day today? Uh, the outside is look uh, clear, but in this office, I feel so cold. Oh. Uh, because of the air con, I suppose. Ah, <laughs> yeah. Would you prefer a sunny day or a rainy day? I prefer sunny day, but it, yeah. I, I, I just sunny day because because uh when when it's sunny yeah, I, I can we we all can go outside without the umbrella. Oh <laughs> <laughs> okay. uh, uh, what about you, Miss Tis? Uh do well, you uh do you prefer sunny or rainy day? Well, actually, I also prefer the sunny day mm -hmm. because I really like a uh, yellow color. So if it's sunny, mm -hmm. everything looks yellow. <laughs> so it's <laughs> very beautiful for me. <laughs> but when it's rainy, then everything is gray. And I really prefer the sunny day. Uh, the perfect color is yellow, right? <laughs> yes. Exactly. But uh, at the moment, I think Surabaya is going to be in its dry season. Yeah, some, sometimes uh, or what dry, dry, dry. It's not the rainy season, <laughs> but the dry season. Oh, yeah. Well, yesterday, well, yesterday, uh, the weather is rainy. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah, thank you for reminding me. Thank you, Mr. Andy. <laughs> okay, now we are going to try to do this between the two of you. <laughs> so I'm going to split you into partners and you get to choose your own topic. But first of all, we're going to practice. So I'm going to put you into breakout rooms in pairs and you're going to practice two topics. Okay, so the first, uh, you're going to talk about the first topic and then you're going to continue right away into the second topic. Okay, so don't stop your conversation, but just try to continue. Now, uh, do you have any preference to partners or randomly? Sh shall I choose randomly? Randomly. Yes, you can choose, please. <laughs> <laughs> okay, then. Randomly, then. Hmm. Uh, I'm going to... Oh, hang on. Oh, this one. Okay. Okay. Uh, you are going to have five minutes to practice two topics in your breakout room when you are called back to the main room, you are going to perform that conversation with your partner for three minutes. So earlier, we, we only had two minutes conversation because it was only one topic, but because you are practicing two topics, you are going to make it longer into three minutes. Remember, English only, <laughs> okay? English only, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Okay, then I'm opening the room, you may join the breakout room.
<laughs> but uh, two for each year, more or more. <laughs> <laughs> but not not far, not far. Just uh, locally. Just locally, okay. So, where are your the most favorite places that you have visited? Uh, I think the, uh, everyone likes Bali. Everyone likes Bali. I, mm. I do agree with that. <laughs> do you agree? Well, yeah, I love Bali too. I love everything about a beach, ocean, ocean and, and the food. <laughs> uh, pardon me? The? Uh, food. Oh, food. The, uh, food, the, the drink, the beer. <laughs> No, beer is prohibited. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's not allowed by our religion. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, 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 no. I, I, I'm not. Uh, I'm not meaning that. Huh. Um. Uh. Yeah. I think Bali is the most. I think in the world the most wanted palace. Uh, the... I'm good. I'm good. How are you? Mira. I'm fine. Thanks. So uh, let's talk about travel. Have you ever been in Jakarta? In Job Jakarta? I have been there before at 2018. 18? 2018. Yeah, 18. 18. Yeah. Uh, what about you? Uh, Jogja is uh, my favorite city after Bali, and uh, I think Jogja, Jogja is quite nice with the Kraton things and uh, the food. The also the it's quite a nice person out there. And um, what is your favorite food in Jogjakarta? Ah. Food, uh, Jogja has uh, great food, great taste for the food. Uh,
Okay, now all of you. Okay. <laughs> How was your practice? Quite good. <laughs> Quite good. Okay. <laughs> it seems that Mr. Wira was I very confident. Kind of. <laughs> kind of. Pardon, Miss Ruth? And I don't know what it's. My my mouth is um like I'm kumur kumur. <laughs> oh yeah, that is one more thing that we are going to do here in our conversation class. So not just that we're practicing to speak English, but we're also practicing yeah. to speak English clearly. Clearly, yeah. Uh -uh. Okay. The, because Mr. Wira was confident about his <laughs> practice, <laughs> we're going to start with him. Okay. <laughs> uh, I have the three minutes here. So, uh, hang on a second. Okay, I have three minutes. Uh, yes. Whenever you're ready, you may start the conversation. Randy, are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, let's start it. One, two, three. Yes. Hi, Ran. How are you? Hello, Ira. I'm good. Thank you. And hey. you? <laughs> I I could I I'm well thank you. Uh, have you ever been in Yogyakarta? Uh, Yogyakarta. Uh, I have been there. Uh, at the twenty and eighteen maybe. Nineteen, yes. Yeah. And uh, how about you? Uh, Jogja is my favorite city after Bali. Uh, uh, the food is very nice and the people, the kraton things and something like that. Uh, I like being in Jogja. And what is your favorite food, Randy? Oh, my favorite food in Jogja. In Jogja, oh. Yeah. And my favorite food in Jogja is Kuduk because Kuduk is sweet, sweet food. I feel, I feel uh, happy with that. <laughs> I don't like spicy food ever. <laughs> How about you, Mr. Wira? Do you like uh, it or something? No, actually, I don't like Kuduk. It's too sweet for me. Uh, I like more spicy food, uh, but. Actually, I, I like to uh, I like place in Yogyakarta that called Angkringan. It's a lot of uh, food, mm, jajanan, oh, jajanan Indonesia, sorry. Yeah, it's like that. <laughs> Something like that. And uh, I think Jogja is the best city, a uh, second city in Indonesia. And uh, in Jogja, uh, which place you ever been um, in Jogja City, Randy? Oh, uh, sorry. You can hear me? Uh, in Jogja, if you ever travel in, uh, to the Kraton place or something like that? Oh, I visit at Jogja. I visit at, at uh, Parang Tritis Beach. You know? Yes. Yes, uh, yeah. Malang, South of Malang. Hey, yes. South of Malang, South of Jogja. <laughs> uh, I feel happy at the beach. I feel so, uh, so comfort. Uh, what do you? What, what about you, Mister Mira? I think uh, Jogja is the best for our conversation like this. And thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Kurang dikit. I'm sorry. Oh, thank you so much. Um, Mr. Ariona and Ms. Ruth, the, can you give comments to Mr. Andy and Mr. Wira's conversation? <laughs> um, I think the, the conversation is too general, yeah. <laughs> no, uh, uh, well, um, speciality on on that conversation is uh, general, general. 
Yeah, Miss <coughs> Ruth, your comment about their conversation? Um, yeah, I agree with um, Adit. I just call Adit, yeah. Is it, is it okay? Uh, I agree with uh, Mas Adit. Um, it's too general and uh, they, are all, they, are, they are also only talking about one topic if uh, I don't. As yeah. about Jogja, but you can divide it with Jogja or and food. <laughs> But I think it's one topic. Oh, I forgot to take yeah. about, talk about hobbies. Hobbies, Randy, hobbies, Randy. Oh, yeah. hobbies. <laughs> I forgot oh, yeah, about yeah. hobbies. That was oh, also I'm my sorry. main problem. Uh, I'm sorry, my my narrow bandwidth is low. <laughs> <laughs> but speaking of being general, when you are doing small talk, it's actually very okay to talk about general things, because. Uh, it is your talk for the first meeting, so you don't want to go too deep into the conversation. However, the requirement is to have two topics of conversation. Uh, yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. I'm too concerned about your uh, what stopwatch timer. <laughs> the timer. The timer. The timer okay. make, killing me, killing my conversation. Okay, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, it's for the first try. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Ruth, Mr. Uh, Adit. Okay, I'm I'm a bit confused. I'll let you. Uh, I'm just going to call you Mr. Ariano then instead of Mr. Adit, so I don't get confused. Just uh, call call him Ambiar, Miss Ambiar. Ambiar, Ambiar. Oh yeah, your second name is Ambiar. <laughs> Are you ready? Whenever you're ready. No, no, not yet, not yet, not yet. Oh, not yet. Okay. <laughs> Uh, Mas Adit, who will start the conversation? Me or you? <laughs> uh, Ms. Ruth, you can start. Okay, okay, we're ready. Go on then. Okay. Hi, Mas Adit. Uh, I'm kind of curious your background. What is your uh, background? My study background is uh, economic management, uh, and I'm focusing on operation management. And then uh, my uh, thesis or my uh, study, I'm stu uh, last apa? Uh, my thesis, yeah, my thesis is uh, about uh, upper up, upper control limit tools that I use now for uh, I use now for work in my division. How about you? Uh, I'm economic background. Um, I don't know if economics go, but uh, it's about my job, about getting paid for living. <laughs> you know, but uh, getting paid for living is kind of important for me too. I have hobbies about traveling too. So uh, I'm get high spirited for, uh, for getting to work so I can get paid and I have money for traveling. You know, I like I like to travel uh, about the seeing the sea, beach, um, and get things snorkeling. How about you? Do you like traveling? Yes, I do. Um, uh, average, I'm traveling twice a year. Twice but, a year, okay. <laughs> yeah, but in pandemic, <laughs> I'm stay at home <laughs> playing games. <laughs> Not going uh, in the uh, uptown or maybe in your uh, city not going up. I mean, uh, the local tourism. Do you have in, Have you been there or in the pandemic period? Uh, in the pandemic, uh, the last travel I, I was go on Yogyakarta. Oh, okay. then, same with the other group. Right? <laughs> and then I uh, I'm back with uh, COVID nineteen in my body. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've heard that from your teammate. Uh, okay. How about you? Uh, what city do you did uh, did you get? Let me see. Time is up. Oh, not yet. Oh, not yet. Okay. Uh, what is your uh, Far, farthest city have you been visit? Uh, I do say my hometown, Medan. 
Hmm, I okay. think everyone loves uh, uh, their own town. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, our, our conversation is uh, Start. It's just, <laughs> it's just that. <clears throat> Mr. Wira and Mr. Randy, please give comments to their conversation. <laughs> Mr. Randy first. Mr. Randy first. The conversation is great. Uh, I think good for two of you. <laughs> okay, good job. <laughs> How about Mr. Wira's comment? I think it was a good conversation, but uh, something, uh, one thing I see that uh, Mr. Adit trying to make, trying to think uh, words to make conversation doing well. That's all. And Mrs. Ruth, uh, yeah, Delay. Okay. <laughs> hey, no, no, I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I do bad, agree with Mr. Wira. Uh, I think Mr. Adit or Mr. Ambiar, <laughs> you thought too much about the words that you need to use. So yes. instead of just making it easy for yourself, you are trying too hard to find the correct words, find the correct, correct expressions, and so. And by the time it goes to the, it went to the last part of the conversation, the pauses are getting longer and longer. Yeah. So. <laughs> yep. <clears throat> That's the kind of thing that we are trying to avoid when we're talking. So uh, try to make your conversation stable as in the pace, not too fast, but not too slow either. If you think you're talking too fast, make it a little bit slower. Typically, normal people speak in this uh, pace. So they don't speak like people on TV, like, hey, what's up? What do you think about this? Blah, blah, blah. I... Okay. <laughs> we don't really talk like that in real life, right? So yeah, yeah, yeah. give yourself the smoother pace. Hmm. the more comfortable pace for you. Okay, so uh, well done for that. Now I'm going to challenge you. Oh no, before we go to our <laughs> challenge, <laughs> uh, I'm going to switch the order. So now Mr. Whoa. Mira is going to be Ms. Ruth's partner and Mr. Randy is going to be Mr. Ariana's <laughs> partner. And this is, the, this is the challenge. So we are going to use the wheel this side to Choose the topic of conversation. Okay. Let's try. What's the first? Ah, oh, watch a terrible film. So about a bad film that you've watched. Okay. Now this one is for any mini mini. Oh, catch talk about it too. Okay, Miss Ruth and Mr. Wira. Are you ready? No practice ready. this time. We're going to try That's to okay. get. Okay. Uh, okay. <clears throat> we're going to try with uh, one and a half minute first. So this yeah. one should be short, not to make you think too much, but keep the conversation going. Okay, and go on then. Hi, Miss Ruth. Hi, Masuira. Don't call me Miss. Uh, I, I kind of oh, okay. <laughs> hearing you yeah, call yeah, me Miss. Yeah. Hi, Ruth. Hi, Ruth. Okay, uh -huh. I can I just call you. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, have you ever watched a movie that you don't like before? It's like a terrible film. Um, I do. I love superhero movies, uh, like Marvel and then Universal Studio, if I like. For the Batman, um, this is then, comic. Oh, DC comics. Okay, okay. Yeah. DC, yeah. DC. Okay. Then uh, I I love every movies, every Marvel movies, but for the DC, I have one movie that I don't like. It's kind of terrible, I think. Um, if you know, um, Batman versus Superman. Have you watched it? Okay, I, I watched it before. Yeah, this is a boring movie. It's, the duration is too long, and uh, I don't get it. What, what, what the best part of that film? Yeah, you know what? You do, do you? No? Okay. 
Yeah, yeah. <laughs> do you do you have uh, another terrible films that you kind of regretting uh, watching that in the movie? You pay for to you pay for too high and you getting a line for watching the film and then the film is disappointed you. Yes, uh, I watched a movie called Twelve uh, Monkeys. Oh, it's a, such a boring movie. Uh, it's it it makes me. Uh, I have to. Uh, <laughs> sorry, uh, I have a lot of things about it. Uh, uh, what kind of movie of that, and uh, what 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 is point of that movie? Movies. Well, oh, it's a boring movie, I think. And thank you. okay, thank, thank you. you so much. Okay. There you go. Pusing <laughs> No, 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 no. I'm sorry. I'm Mr. sorry. Mr. Wira is getting his karma. Like <laughs> earlier, he talked that Mr. Ariano was thinking too much about the world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Overthinking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I noticed. Then... I noticed. I noticed. Yeah, yeah. There you go. <laughs> okay. Uh, nice one, by the way. Oh, before we go to Mr. Andy and Mr. Ariano, uh, this is what I need to share to you. So. Okay. So for a man, it's pretty simple. It's always Mr. Mr. But for women, we have three things. We have Mrs. The deal is when you use Mrs., you need to use the, the husband's name. So for example, you don't say Mrs. Iriana, but you actually say Mrs. Jokowi, Mrs. Joko. So not the, the female name, but the husband's name. Okay, that's Mrs. And then we have Miss. Miss, M-I-S-S, -S, refers to unmarried woman, young woman. That's what Miss Ruth was talking about. I think I'm too old to be called Miss. But actually, we are calling you with this one. C, Miss Ruth. Yep. Uh, typically, <laughs> typically, in workplace, everyone is a Miss. So in a workplace. Because we call... The woman with their own name, not the husband's name. So everyone is Miss, not this Miss, but this Miss. Okay. Um, even though the person is 70 years old or 17 years old, I still call the person Miss. There you go. <clears throat> um, oh, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> I haven't chosen a topic <laughs> for Mr. Andy and Mr. Wira. Okay, let's see what topic. Oh, sorry, sorry. Mr. Mr. Ariano. <laughs> let's see what topic they're going to talk about. Oh, no. <laughs> Play game. Oh. Wow. <laughs> okay, that should be an easy topic for both of them. Okay. Are you ready? Oh, oh. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. Go on then. Hello, Miss Ariano. Yes. How are you? <laughs> hey. What do you like? Hey, are you like playing game? Yes, uh, I do like playing game very well. Um, usually I play one or two hours each day. How about you? <laughs> I like playing game too, but I don't have console on at my house. Uh, long, long time ago, I have one uh, that is a PlayStation 2. Well, you know, it's broken now. <laughs> Well, uh, by the way, what favorite game you play? Oh, uh, my favorite game is football, uh, and the title is FIFA 21. When I was so young, I play winning 11 4 or winning 11. So, well, I know, I know that. I know that. <laughs> have you have you play play that? Ah, uh, yeah. yeah. Well, long time ago, I played the game too 
uh, is uh, uh, winning elephant ya toh winning elephant seven or something else I, I I forgot the title I think it's good game uh, for me uh, uh, because I don't like playing soccer at the real world <laughs> I just playing at game. Uh, uh, okay. okay. Thank you so much, Mr. Andy and Mr. Aryana. Thank you. Uh, one comment from me, Mr. Andy. Yes. <laughs> you're um, you're thinking too much about what you want to say. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it should be more natural, more uh, smoother. Sorry, not more smoother. Smoother. And since you are talking about the thing that you are doing, what well, what you like, what you're doing well, it should be easier for you to do it, I think. But it's okay, no problem. Sometimes we get that mental block in our head. Oh, what do I want to say? Um, That's actually the mental block that we need to take off from our um, head. Okay. So, uh, by the way, uh, is is it true that you haven't gotten your physical book? No, no. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Oh. I just have the soft copy. Not yet, ma'am. <coughs> so, uh, because I'm going to ask you to do the listening section, okay, we have this part. Uh, I suppose you all know how to annotate on my screen. Okay, yeah. I'm going to play the audio once, and I'm going to ask you to annotate the the expressions that are used in this conversation. Did you hear the audio? Yes, miss. Conversation in English. Book three. Student book. Listening script. Lesson one. <laughs> Activity 2. Listen again and think the expressions used in the conversation. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Quantum Limited. As this is our very first meeting, let's introduce ourselves. I'm Janessa Bernstein. Please call me Nessa. I'm the sales manager. I've been with Quantum for three months now. From now on, you'll be working with me. Now, your turn. Let's start with our lady sales rep. Please. Hello, everyone. My name is Natalinda Liu. I am from Bandung. I live in Griyanyaman Housing Complex, not far from this office. I'm glad to meet you all. Also, I'm happy to be part of this growing company. Nice to meet you, Ms. Liu. Please call me Talia. Okay. Thanks, Talia. Next, please. Hi, I'm Dino. My complete name's Hafifuddin Mohalisi. I'm from Ternate. I moved to Jakarta last month. This is my very first job. I hope I can be the best sales rep in this company. I'm sure you can, Dino. Good morning, everybody. I'm Ramon Sujarwo. I'm from Balikpapan, Kalimantan. I was born and grew up there. I'm sure we can work together. Yes, Ramon. We sure hope so. Now that everyone knows one another, let's... Okay. So, could you please tick the correct answers on my screen? Which expressions did you hear in the conversation? Remus, is it uh, for question number two? Yes, this one. Oh, okay. okay. So you can tick it in the box. I 
see Miss Ruth and Mr. Wira. Mr. Randy and Mr. Ariana. Uh, I can take the screen. Mm -mm, yes, please. How, how to take, just click the screen or? Uh, if you see up there, you will see options. Yes. Please click options. And then, and then you will have annotate. Oh, okay. Okay, Mr. Andy is there. Squid. <clears throat> oh, okay. Okay. Got it. Is that all? Does anybody want to add more? Mm. No. <coughs> okay. So uh, only one person, only uh, Miss Ruth, take the good morning, everyone. Did you all hear good morning, everyone? Did mm -hmm. you hear it in the conversation? Mm. No? <laughs> That's actually the first thing that the the first thing the, yes, <laughs> yeah, but that. the person said. So let's check it one more time. And this Activity time, let's two. check your answer. Listen again and take the expressions used in the conversation. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Quantum Limited. As this is our uh -huh. very first meeting, let's introduce ourselves. I'm Janessa Bernstein. Please call me Nessa. I'm the sales manager. I've been with Quantum for three months now. From now on, you'll be working with me. Now, your turn. Let's start with our lady sales rep. Please. Hello, everyone. My name's Natalinda Liu. I am from Bandung. I live in Griyanyaman Housing Complex, not far from this office. I'm glad to meet you all. Also, I'm happy to be part of this growing company. Nice to meet you, Ms. Liu. Please call me Talia. Okay, thanks, Talia. Next, please. Hi, I'm Dino. My complete name's Hafifuddin Mohalisi. I'm from Ternate. I moved to Jakarta last month. This is my very first job. I hope I can be the best sales rep in this company. I'm sure you can, Dino. Good morning, everybody. I'm Ramon Sujarwo. I'm from Balikpapan, Kalimantan. I was born and grew up there. I'm sure we can work together. Yes, Ramon. We sure hope so. Now that everyone knows one another, let's... Okay, so well done. You got all the correct answers, including good morning, everyone, and I was born in Balikpapan. Why do you think they didn't say good night to you all? Um, because it's what it's introducing it's in, in the office. <laughs> Uh, don't you think sometimes we have to do extra work? Um, but not uh, like introducing yourself if is it about extra work. Mm, got it. Okay. And one more thing that uh, I need to tell you that whenever you say good night, it's for goodbye. Oh, yeah. so even if you meet somebody oh. at night, you don't say good night, but we actually say good evening. Even if it's 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock, we still say good evening. By the time we say good goodbye, that's when we say good night. Okay. Uh, nice one. I like it. Did you pay attention to their accents? Do you think they have accents? Yeah. Yep. Yes. The first speaker, do you think she was a native speaker or... Say an Indonesian. Janessa. I think, I think I think Indonesian. You think Indonesian? Okay. How about the Miss Liu, Mr. Dino, and Mr. Ramon? Do you think they have accents? 
air Indonesia. Oh, I can differentiate. <laughs> okay, I'm going to try and play it again, and I'm going to ask you whether you can detect their accents or not. Oh, uh, it's not playing. Wait, wait. I have. No. Oh, no. This is what happened with Google. Hmm. Wait, wait. I always get this problem with Google. They play several times, and then when it comes to the you have this. to download it. Yes, exactly. I don't know why. Okay, can you hear the audio? No. Oh. No audio? No audio. No audio. No audio. Oh. I'm Janessa Bernstein. Yes. Please Hi. call me Nessa. I'm the sales manager. I've been with Quantum for three months now. From now on, you'll be working with me. Now, your turn. Let's start with our lady sales rep. Please. Hello, everyone. My name's Natalinda Liu. I'm from Bandung. I live in Griyanyaman Housing Complex, not far from this office. I'm glad to meet you all. Also, I'm happy to be part of this growing company. Nice to meet you, Ms. Liu. Please call me Talia. Okay. Thanks, Talia. Next, please. Hi, I'm Dino. My complete name's Hafifuddin Mohalisi. I'm from Ternate. I moved to Jakarta last month. This is my very first job. I hope I can be the best sales rep in this company. I'm sure you can, Dino. Good morning, everybody. I'm Ramon Sujarwo. I'm from Balikpapan, Kalimantan. I was born and grew up there. I'm sure we can work together. Yes, Ramon. We sure hope so. Now that everyone knows one another, let's... Okay. So do you think they have accents? I think yes. You the think? first female speaker, I think the native <laughs> one. Mm -hmm. The first female speaker is native. The rest native, of them yeah. are Indonesian. They have Indonesian. accents. Yeah. yeah. But do you understand what they're saying? Did they speak uh, yeah. clear enough? Yes, I think. Yeah. Yes. yes, they speak clear enough. Yep. That's the point that uh, I want to underline. So each and every one of us has accent, and it's perfectly fine to have an accent. You don't have to try to eliminate your accent. Mm -hmm. What you need to do or what you need to achieve in conversation is to have your words intelligible or your words be understood by your partner, your audience, and so on. So if you are having a, oh my God, I need to have this American accent or a British accent or Australian accent. If that's your goal, that's fine, but you don't have to push yourself to have that goal. It's not necessary, okay? Uh, besides, nowadays in the world, there is this English called the world English. So, Everybody speaks English with their own accent, Indian accent, Brazilian accent, uh, Eastern European accent, and so on. <coughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, what else do I want to say? Oh, yeah. English, don't, is it okay? <laughs> don't be ashamed with your accent. Be ashamed if you cannot say what your opinion is clearly. There you go. Now, let's go on. <coughs> oh, no. 
I'm having a cough bug. Mm -mm. And it's terrible because it's Ramadan. <laughs> 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 okay there you go this is uh, Janessa's office we're going to try to practice this conversation this is very formal even though it's still about small talk so I'm going to ask uh, Mr. Ariano and Mr. Wira to be yes. Janessa and Chandra Abimanyu <coughs> And read out. Sorry, so sorry. I am so so sorry. I have this cough. Uh, Mr. Ariano, could you please be Janessa and Mr. Wira? Could you please be Chandra Abimanyu? Okay, Miss. Okay. So. Whoa. Hang on. How do I make this? Wait, wait. Hmm. Okay, can you read the whole conversation? Yes. Okay, go on yes. then. Okay, uh, can I stop? Yes, please. Okay. Uh, yes, come, come in, Mr. Wira. Close the door, please. Hello, nice to meet you, Mr. Wira. I didn't see you in our cells sales rep meeting this morning. Mr. Wira, please have a seat. Should, do I have to be Mr. Wira or Chandra Bimanyu, miss? You can change your name into <laughs> Mr. Wira, no problem. Okay, okay, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Good afternoon, Mr. Adit. I'm Chandra, I'm Wira Lexcon. Thank you. I'm sorry, my flight was delayed and I, I got stuck in traffic jam all the way here from the airport. That's too bad. Well, Jakarta is notorious for its heavy traffic. So you came here directly from the airport? Yes, that's right. I see. Where are you from, Mr. Wira? Lombok. Mm, you, uh, Mat Mataram? No, I'm from Praia, Central Lombok. Have you ever been to Lombok, Mr. Adit? Yes, last month. I stay in Sengigi. Serene is Serene and Seren. <coughs> Seren, Seren and beautiful beach. There aren't many tourists. Anyway, please call me Mr. Adit. Okay. Thank you so much. Uh, there are several things that I'm underlining here. So, <coughs> oh man, so sorry. Uh, how do you say this first word anyway? So. <coughs> sales or sales? Sales, correct. Sales. Sales, got it. Sales. Sales. So there's a, a Y in the middle. Sales. 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 Compare it with this one. Okay. This is when you say sales. Oh. Sales, oh yeah. Sales, sales. Sales. This one is sales straight no y in the middle but this one sales sales right. uh how about this two words the airport yeah thank you very much the airport the, <clears throat> the airport. airport the airport and then this is uh is uh it was actually already correct but the deal is when you want to sound fluent in speaking, you need to combine certain things. So for example, like this, these two words, state and in, instead of saying, I stayed in Sangigi, I stayed in. Oh, okay. I stayed I, in Sangigi. I stayed in. And then this one. 
Anybody? <laughs> no, no idea. It's Serene. 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 Okay. Serene. Could, uh, could you please Google the meaning of serene? I'm not going to tell you. You need to find it yourself. <laughs> what does it mean okay. anyway by serene? <laughs> serene. Serene. It's like a uh, name. <laughs> Some women are named serene because of that quality. Peaceful. Peaceful. Got peaceful. It. So when you have a daughter and the daughter seems peaceful, she is not crying, you can name her serene. Serene. Serene, okay. <clears throat> serene and beautiful beaches. So is Serena Munaf is the daughter. Serena. <laughs> Serena. Serena. Uh. <laughs> Uh, probably I don't know. Probably that's the the Arabic spelling of serene. I don't know. <laughs> oh yeah, one more thing. This word. Okay, how do you say the word? Beaches. Mm, well done. So it is beaches longer. Beaches. Yep. Please don't beaches. say. Beaches. Mm -mm. Some people actually said bitches. Bitches. <laughs> when you say that one, that became the female dog. So, Bitch. oh, yeah, I see. <laughs> <laughs> so, you need to say yeah. beaches, beach, beaches. longer. Beaches. 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 Serene and beautiful beaches. Now, beautiful. before I go to Mr. and Mr. Randy, besides stating which words that you can combine. Um, uh, when we find a foreign, a foreigner in Indonesia, when they first came to Indonesia, they usually spoke uh, like this: "Saya tidak suka makan nasi." So, the words are very clear, very cut. And that's also what happened to people who speak English. <clears throat> if they want to get more fluent, they need to combine some words. Saya tidak suka makan nasi. Combine. So which ones that you think you can combine? My flight was delayed and... <clears throat> My flight was delayed. I, I got stuck. Stuck in traffic. I, uh, actually, this one, you can combine this. Sorry. My flight was delayed and I. Delayed and I. Delayed and I. Oh, and I. Mm -mm. Delayed then. Delayed and oh, I. Delayed and delayed and. All three. Delayed and, delayed and I. Delayed and I. My flight was delayed and I got stuck. Mm. Anything else? Delayed. Mm. This is the easy one. This is also can be combined. So instead of saying, mm -hmm, there you go. Instead of saying good afternoon, good off, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Uh, <clears throat> and then this one also. Where are you? Where are? Where are? Where are? Where are? Where are? Where are? Oh, we try to speak it very clearly sometimes that it shows we are not native speaker. Where are you from? It is okay when you want to underline the words, but if it's just a normal conversation, where are you from? Where are? Where are you from? <clears throat> Have, uh, have you ever been bisa uh, is, is it can be have you uh, ever oh have you ever have you ever been yeah have you ever been have been okay now i'm going to ask uh mr randy and miss ruth to do the conversation mr randy please do janessa and then miss ruth please do chandra abimanyu okay 
<clears throat> yes, come in. Close the door, please. Hello. Good, up. Huh? Good afternoon, Mr. Randy. I'm Ruth. Hello, nice to meet you. Ruth, I didn't see you in our sales rep meeting this morning. Please have a seat. Thank you. I'm sorry. My flight was delayed and I got stuck in, stuck in a traffic jam all the way here from the airport. That's too bad. Well, Jakarta is notorious for its heavy traffic. So you came here directly from the airport. Yes, that's right. I see. Where are you from? Where are you from, Ruth? Lombok. Mataram? No, I'm from Praia, Central Lombok. Have you ever been then to Lombok, uh, Mr. Randy? Yes. Last month, I stayed in Sengingi, serene and beautiful beach. There are many tourists anyway. If there are many tourists. Anyway, please call me Randy. Okay, thank you. <clears throat> Mr. Randy, beaches. Beaches. One thing only, yeah, beaches. beaches. Serene. 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 Beautiful Serene. beaches. Yeah. Serene beaches. Serene. Beaches. Uh, now I'm going to discuss about intonation a little bit. Typically in English, the intonation is going down for most of the sentences. Except when you have a question that needs a yes, no answer. So for example, is your name Ariono? We go up, is your name Ariono? But when we ask what's your name, it's actually going down. So it goes like a hill or a mountain. It goes like this, what's your name? But if it's yes, no question, it's usually going up. Is your name Randy? There you go. The same with sentences. Typically sentences and with a down intonation. So <clears throat> when you say this one, I didn't see you in our sales rep meeting this morning. This morning. So it's going down. Instead of, I didn't see you in our sales rep meeting this morning. This morning. Mm -hmm. Going down. Please have a seat. Again, it's going down. Please have a seat. Okay. Uh, where can you find? Do we have any rising intonation? The one like this in the conversation? Can you please identify which sentence has a rising intonation? Have you ever been to Lombok, Mr. Bernstein? Excellent, Mr. Vera. That's the, the exact sample of rising intonation. Have you ever been to Lombok, Miss Bernstein? <clears throat> How about the falling intonation for a question? Uh, going. Oh, yeah. It's going up. Yes, last month. The it's falling up, one? Right. This one, the falling intonation for a question. Oh, the falling intonation. Okay. Mm -hmm. Where, Where are, are you from, from Chandra? Chandra? Well done. Where mm -hmm. are you from? Uh, we go up for the name only. So, where are you from, Chandra? Chandra. But the question itself is going where up. Are you where from? are you from, Chandra? Okay. Most Indonesian would go, where are you from, Chandra? But actually, the intonation yeah, yeah. is going down. Sometimes from intonation, we can uh, tell that a person is not a native speaker. Now, this, this is the kind of thing that we need to fix. So instead of acquiring an accent, we can actually ac acquire the correct intonation for sentences. Okay. So, uh, okay, there you go. I'm about to end this session, but before we end the session, I'm going to ask you to
tell me one thing that you are um, taking from our lesson today. So reflection, what are you going to take home from this lesson? I'm going to start with Mr. Wira. It seems that he is ready. <laughs> I think this is uh, such a good lesson. Uh, it's, it makes me want to uh, uh, what is it? want to make a conversation in English again <laughs> because uh, I, I have I have my brother I, I have cousin that uh, married with a uh, 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 in uh, Scotland uh, man and uh, I quite a great conversation with him and my cousin is back to the Hong Kong and nobody else <laughs> to oh. make a conversation. I see. Thank you, Mr. Thank you. Wira. Miss mm. Ruth, what are you going to take from this lesson? Um, how to talk <laughs> The Indonesian is kind of uh, useful and new things for me uh, that if you're going to ask something, someone, there is a, a, a rising. high and a rising and falling. Oh, yeah, falling, falling Indonesian. Okay, thank you. Mr. Randy, what are you going to take? I was practice a lot <laughs> to better my speak and my knowledge about conversation. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, sometimes what we are lacking with is the practice. So we already know the, the topic, the subject, the lesson. We know that we've learned many, many years, but then when it comes to making real conversations, we go like, oh, what am I going <laughs> <Yeah>. to say? <laughs> Mr. Ariana, your reflection. Uh, I'm interested in uh, topic of conversation, how to make conversation uh, flow, flowing, and how to make conversation uh, interesting. I see. Yeah. I would like to say thank you so much for joining me in our first session. Uh, by the way, I got a note from Miss Fifi earlier asking me to change the schedule into 2.30. Yeah. Yep. So for the next session, we are going to have it at 2.30. 2.30, yeah. Until uh, 4 o'clock then. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So 2.30 is on Thursday. Thank you, Miss Tati. Thank you so much okay. for joining me, everybody. Okay. I'll see you on Thursday. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Uh, okay. Thank you, Mr. T. Bye-bye.